Hey there, Michael Griffiths, founder of Referral Marketing Guru, number one authority on referral marketing training around the globe. I don't get enough referrals from our clients. I hear it all the time. So there's a couple of problems if your referral strategy is purely relying on client referrals. A lot of the time, we don't have enough clients to then get many referrals from our clients. See, if you've only got 5, 10, 15 clients, well, the most you can get are 5, 10, 15 of referrals every month or every quarter. So client numbers determine whether getting referrals from clients is going to be a good growth strategy or not. Now, sure, getting the odd one, two, three from clients, I just see as like the cherry on top, something great, but it's not something that you should rely upon. See, I saw a post the other day on, I think it might have been LinkedIn, where growing your business by referrals is not a good growth strategy because you don't get enough referrals. And in a way, I tend to agree. For 99% of people out there, it's exactly right. They don't get enough referrals. And therefore, growing their business purely on referrals is a stupid growth idea. But that doesn't have to be the case. See, you can get plenty of referrals. You can grow your business purely on referrals. It's about having a right system. I'll talk about that shortly. Make sure you remember to jump in, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Referral Marketing Guru. Grab our nine-point referral game plan at michaelgriffiths.com.au forward slash plan. And make sure you come and join us at the Referral Network Facebook group. Jump onto Facebook, search the Referral Network, and come hang out with us over there also. So back to systemizing client referrals. You need a way for your clients to realize that passing you referrals on a consistent basis is a good idea. Not just when they happen to think about it or not just when you happen to ask, but on a consistent basis. Now, to me, if you simply go, client, I'm looking for more people who are like you to be able to work with. That's sort of, that's difficult. It's usually a little bit awkward too. Instead, why don't you have something that your clients could share or promote to people within their network when they come across the right people? Something that adds value and makes your client look good. You see, what we do is we get our clients simply to be able to share our nine-point referral game plan. So we talk to our clients and we go, hey, if you come across people in your network that would like more referrals, here's our nine-point referral game plan that you could share with them. And that then makes it nice and easy for them to do something, add value to the people in their network, and make them look good without having to think about specific names, numbers, emails. So have a think, what could you do that makes it easier for your clients to be able to refer you, for your clients to be able to find new business for you? What makes it easier for your clients to do things on a consistent basis, not only when you just happen to ask? Remember, this is the first time you're joining us. Welcome. But make sure you come over to the Referral Network Facebook group. Come hang out with us there. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, Referral Marketing Guru. You can always find me on any of the social media platforms. Just search for Michael Griffiths and grab our nine-point referral game plan at michaelgriffiths.com.au forward slash plan. Client referrals don't have to be hard. Think about how you make it easier, systemize it, and then just simply get your clients to promote something for you that's going to help fill your CRM with more people from their networks. Right guys, that's it from me. Until next time, take care. I'll see you soon.